Now before I go into the review, I just want to make a comment about the smell of this product. Instantly, when I opened it up and, and smelled this product, it's, it's growing on me a little bit, little bit, but instantly I kind of got a, I don't know what it is about the smell, it's kind of like a, a really sweet, but also, I wouldn't say pleasant smell, and that's just my opinion. Um, it smells maybe like a funeral home, or something that, some something about the smell just doesn't give me a good vibe. So I don't know what it is. I can't explain it. It just it might be a product that's rebranded and promoted on TV. You know, it might be a product under a different name that they use in you know public restrooms or you know even funeral homes, as it reminded me. Uh, but it's just something about the product. It didn't have a pleasant smell. It's grown on me a little bit, but um, it's not the best smelling product in the world. Even though it is not you know an offensive smell is just not the best so this is how the what odor test is going to be set up um, we're going to have four rags we're going to saturate each rag with a cigar here's the cigar and uh, we're going to burn it down and saturate these rags with the cigar smoke one of the hardest things to get out of clothes so we're going to spray the first rag with what odor right here? The second rag with vodka right here. I'm gonna put in the spray bottle and, and spray this rag. And if you've seen Mythbusters, that's what they do. And it actually worked. And let's see if it works better than what odor. And then the third rag right here, we're gonna spray with laundry detergent, just regular laundry soap. And then the fourth rag will be um, sprayed with nothing, and that'll be the control. So I'll run them through uh, one cycle of. Uh, laundry and uh, see which one comes out smelling the freshest cleanest and compare so I have this cigar right here and then we're gonna put it in right here and then of course it'll be lit the cigar smoke will smoke up and then on top of this bucket we'll have the rag so each rag will be each equally saturated with the cigar smoke Okay, so the cigar is now smoking. Every two minutes, I'll rotate the rag that's on the bottom to the top so that each rag gets uh, equal distribution of the cigar smoke. So each one's equally as saturated. Okay, so the cigar's burnt out. Let me do the smell test. And these smell uh, disgusting. These are absolutely saturated with cigar smoke. So now I'm gonna do the real test. I'm going to spray each one with the, we have the what odor, we have the vodka, and then we have the just regular laundry detergent, and we're going to see which one um, comes out smelling the cleanest. And then we have the control, of course, and nothing will be done to that. So let's get started. Number one, what odor. And what's great about what odor is it's uh, safe for pets, humans, environment, carpets, furniture, upholstery. It's non-toxic, non-hazardous, and biodegradable. So that's great. So here we go. I'm going to spray it. The what odor. And I'm just going to spray it on this product with this cloth right here that's been saturated with the cigar smoke. All right. So spray mist evenly over area. Odors will start to fade immediately. And it actually smells a whole lot better right off the bat. I can hardly smell the cigar smoke. So, and it actually, the smell in the bottle smells differently than when you when you missed it. When you missed it, it actually smells a lot fresher. It and I, I do get a hint of cigar smoke, but it smells a lot fresher than it did before. So we have number one, the what odor. Now we're gonna go with number two which is the vodka mixture here's the vodka and like so I'm just going to spray this on alright I'm going to smell it uh, smells like vodka and cigars smells like a bar 
keep spraying this. Get it nice and saturated with vodka. All right, and so we're gonna watch, and then we have the uh, laundry detergent, of course, and then the control. The laundry detergent will just be washed with laundry detergent. All of these will be washed separately, so not to, you know, contaminate each uh, cloth. And let's see what happens. I'm gonna go wash them, and next will be the result. So, now for the results. I washed these towels, uh, each separately, using the detergent, the vodka, nothing, and the um, the what odor. So, without further ado, the test results. So, um, I found that the detergent did the best job for getting out the cigar smoke. Second was the vodka. And then third, surprisingly, was just plain water. And I'll explain later. And, uh, and then here, is the uh, it's turned around here the uh, what odor coming in last and yes it did get out the smell but the reason I put it on last is there was a residual smell of the what odor spray it's strong stuff it stays you know stuck to whatever you spray it on it's not the best smelling stuff in my opinion and so um, as far as getting out the cigar smoke, on contact, um, the what odor did hide the cigar smell um, on the rag initially. So it became horrible into something that um, when you sprayed it on, it did cover up the cigar smoke. So on that basis, if you want to cover up a smell, in my opinion, with a not so great smell, then what odor is, is great for that. Pretty much everything got out most of the smell. I would just, you know, as far as laundry goes, detergent, vodka did great, uh, water did alright, and the only reason I put it last is yes the smell is gone, but it has a residual uh, odor of the what odor, or has, you know, a residual smell of the what odor. So uh, those are my results, and um, once again, if you do want to cover up a smell, and one of the most potent smells is cigar smoke. What odor does cover it up, but since it's not a pleasant smell in itself, um, I I don't I wouldn't I wouldn't go around spraying my carpet. I wouldn't go around spraying my clothes. I wouldn't go around spraying practically anything unless it was outside or you know a, a car you know like an old old car you didn't care about. Um, but. It just, it just, I, I wouldn't recommend it. It doesn't smell great. Um, yes, it covers it up with a smell that lingers, and uh, but it's, I don't think it's worth it. I think you'd be better bet using a, a soap or something that didn't leave a lingering smell. So uh, there you go, and I hope you enjoy my review of what odor.